consider joining the GOAT list for just a dollar a month and helping support the channel. Link down below in the description. Thank you guys. Hey guys, I'm Mikey I'm back here for another video. Guys, surprisingly, the Overwatch like, promo is out today. Now, I expect it to come out tomorrow just because that's when everything expires. Also, I thought Elite Packs were going to come out today and then uh, would lead into them expiring tomorrow for Friday. But it looks like it came out today. Now, the Color Rush promo, as you can see right here, we have two Color Rush tabs. We have Gold Color Rush players and we have Elite Color Rush players. So, Gold is going to be Gold Dark Uniform Rush and as you can see, it does take two gold tokens. It looks like that is the case for each of these uh, Color Rush sets. Very surprising to not use any kind of silvers, but again guys, for silvers, hold up and wait. The Thanksgiving promo might go ahead and use them, or you may have a promo in between them that uses silvers. So just keep in mind that EA Pi has a um, goal for them down the line. Nonetheless, here though, again, the gold color rush uniforms and then the elite color rush uniforms. The elite color rush uniform uses the Bears alternate and then the Bears tier 3 dark uniform. Now, once you combine these two together, you do receive tier 3 uniform for the Chicago Bears elite dark color rush uniform with tier 3 team training chemistry that cannot be auctioned traded. Same thing for each of these, uh, combining for each one. As you can see, you need to go ahead and get the Bills official Color Rush Uniform Alternate and then uh, Tier 3 of Dark Uniform. Now going ahead and looking at the auction block, you can go ahead and see that we do have uh, a way to purchase with either coins or money these uniforms. So you see right here, we got the Baltimore Ravens going down the line here. This is one I'll probably end up picking up. But again, you have to go ahead and, I believe, get one of these and then go ahead and complete the set. So, kind of weird, you know, definitely. I'm um, going to call some coins, but obviously this promo, it, they're all new players out. And I'll show you guys new players in a second. But obviously this promo is about uniforms, is about the color rush. So, not too surprising that they made it more about that this year than last year. Uh, nonetheless, though, no new solo challenges, no new objectives. They're not really doing that. They're just doing, and no mutt rewards, of course. We already knew that was going to happen. But just Color Rush. Other than Color Rush, we do have new GOAT players. Yes, guys. Interesting. We have Franco Harris and we have Calvin Johnson. Are they going to be on the GOAT tab? They are not going to be on the GOAT tab. Interesting. So yes, we have new goats. We have Calvin Johnson and we have Franco Harris. So not 100% sure how to get them. I thought they would be under the goat tab in all honesty. Let's see if there's any exclusive offer to get them. Does not look like it is. Did, did this change to nine goats or is this still at the same? Right, it looks like it's still at the same five goats. Wait, which includes seven squad packs. Okay, so nothing new about that. So not 100% sure right now on how to get the GOATs, but I'll go ahead and show you guys Mutthead, and we'll go ahead and look at some of the players for today. Obviously, David Johnson and KJ Wright being the limited time cards, and let's go ahead and take a look at what we got here. So if we go ahead and look at Mutthead real fast, you're going to see... Uh, if we go ahead and look at my head real fast, we're going to right here. We Again, we do have some new players, which is kind of interesting. Again, not sure how you get the new GOATs. But we got David Johnson right here with 91 speed. Very, very nice card. Then we have KJ Wright coming in with 83 speed. We have Team of the Week, uh, Zach Brown, obviously. Just Team of the Week players. I don't know if they just updated on my head or what, but <laughs> interesting. Um... And it looks like, okay, so here we go. So here are the new GOATs, quote-unquote. We have Calvin Johnson, Franco Harris, as I, let me zoom out a little bit so you guys can see the stats of these cards. Calvin Johnson, Franco Harris, Michael Strahan. There you go. Michael Strahan. So we have three new GOATs, and as you can see, it says these players can be upgraded to 90 overall by obtaining baby GOATs. So, apparently, if you obtain baby goats, you can upgrade these three goats to 90 overall. 
I'm not sure what the set is. There's no set in the game right now to add them. And to be honest, when I go ahead and go to view all, they don't show up. So I don't know if EA put these in the game by accident or my head by accident. And these are like for, you know, tomorrow or next day or something like that. Maybe Saturday. But with that in mind, guys, three new baby goats. No idea what EA is going to do with them. If they're going to be like a separate thing coming out. But that's pretty much it, guys. No Car Rush players. Um, when I said there was more, I meant to say there's limited time cards. But it's no Car Rush players for this promo. This is strictly just the uniforms and that's it. So kind of disappointing that it's not anything more than just the uniforms again in previous years we did have players that went along with the uniform we had solo challenges not this year no objective list just about you know you go ahead and complete the sets you get your uniform you want and you move on not that crazy of a promo when it comes to that aspect again kind of wish ea would have went with last year when they went with players I would have used silver tokens if they went, went, went ahead and went with players. We would have saw a silver market rise. We would have saw a lot of silvers, you know, going for more coins because of that. Now, I want to cover a little key tip real fast, guys. I know a lot of people have uh, been commenting and saying, like, well, silvers can't go up in price because they have, a, they have this pack in the game. Go ahead and go to packs. You have get a player pack. Just keep in mind, guys, EA removes packs all the time from this game whenever a new bundle comes out whenever something comes out they always remove packs nothing is saying that they would not remove this pack if they did go ahead and release a promo in these silvers there's no way like there's nothing stopping ea from removing this pack so just keep that in mind that this pack is not like 100 percent guaranteed it's going to be in the store the whole entire year they could go ahead and remove it because they release something that needs silvers so just keep that in mind that this pack right now is in the store but this could be removed at any single second second thing if they do go ahead and release something that does need silvers they could go ahead and do 60 to 64 and 65 to 69 you know wild card silvers at different like you know quantities like that and this pack would not affect that because if it's 65 69 overall silvers and you open up this pack, you're not guaranteed to get a, you know, silver at 65-69. You're guaranteed to get a silver, period. Or you could go ahead and get a gold. So if you get a gold or 60-64 overall silver, you're not getting the silver you need for the set. So therefore, it's kind of pointless. At the same time, you're not, you know, it's not going to uh, hurt the market for silvers at all. With that in mind, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like, button, subscribe, and share if you're new. See you guys in the next one. Peace out.